Hello guys, how you doing? I'm doing good wars now. We got uh, after Matthew. So this is the first fight. We will begin this. I'm gonna try to chunk down a bit of this retest on the first turn. Don't want to straight uh Okay, I think now I can clear it. As you can see no problem. I just had to chunk down uh to avoid them to heal him. So yeah, everything is fine now. Because if I use my second skill on the first turn they would just like heal it in and then things could have gone bad or at least like delayed As you can see this T9 fight team was a pure natural 5 team and you can beat this team with natural 2 or 3 you just need like you just need like to do the right things the good runes and you'll be able to do anything you want have to kill this guy and I didn't really want to lose my MSAT Not gonna attack him because I now I know that he has a revenge home. On the worst scenario here, I would just lose my my Mazetti, but I wouldn't lose this fight. See the next fight now uh, <coughs> for this guy. His defense log was pretty good in the beginning of the week. Let's find another one now. There are a lot of plus two guys here. I don't know what would be like more more interesting to see. <coughs> I'm just thinking like what would you guys would want to see because actually I could like fight a lot of those guys you know there are as an example this first team they don't have like the spell so I could abuse it with my with this team that I have three turns immunity and the second one is very easy with Ramaran it's just this team that can be like a bit more uh, because Orion area and G but I think they may like like a bit of damage with the test, like if you go with a poor fire team.
I try to show how you abuse this kind of things. Because actually, like I was saying, I could fight like a lot of those guys. I have like all the tools to beat them. I don't know if I use Rika or Kali. I mean, my homunculus. This is my homunculus, by the way. I made him to combo with my Rika because both have like hike the. <sighs> Both have high critical damage and 62 critical rate to combo. <coughs> no, this is my... This is the right corner. Yeah, I think pretty much I'm going to use my Rika. I could use my Omunculus, but I like the debuffs on Rika on third skill. And my Omunculus isn't max skill yet, so I don't not on mood to use him. We can use the exactly same thing as, as the last fight. Or actually, I'm thinking about something else here. <coughs> we don't need to. We can go like this. Oh, I can't use two corners. Too bad. True. I have to keep my this corner here. I wish I had Tion ready. Would be fun, but my Tion isn't uh, ready yet, and just I'm leveling him yet. I want to show you guys this one. I think I can, like, he's really, f really, really fun to use, I love him. But I, I'm gonna need immunity here. This is the problem. <coughs> so I think <coughs> I can just use my standard team or I could beat with other teams. I don't know. But this team is safe anyway because... I have my 3 turn immunities and I'm not gonna lose this fight. So yeah, let's go. If I had my, my T on ready, this would be easier. Gonna start with the stun here, try to stun someone. Gonna cleanse her out of the buffs. I can just go like this now. And we're gonna knock him down. This is my purifier team. The one I use versus those compositions. <laughs> Where we can abuse it. The only problem I need to rework my Kelly because like she's too squishy. She dies to Orion's criticals like this. And this can be a bit annoying. I can see without the spell, like these things are pure crap. You do lose on the right first turn because they don't have the spells. So, whatever, you can go first, but you're not gonna land any debuffs. And this is a very easy tactic, you can do that with a lot of things. I'm just gonna have to focus this Anavel.
I use this thing because it's my most solid one, but like you guys can see, you can abuse this kind of things with uh, real rooms. That's why real rooms are so important. <laughs> you could mm. do it with anything with immunity on the three guys on the first turn. I could try something new for you guys um, because I think you you may be a bit tired of seeing like the same fights, but well. Like for example, I wanna try something here, but well, I'm still thinking like. I hate these guys on defense because like they're so unpredictable like they can win just by on the first turn just by uh taking someone wheel rune and they break they break then on the first turn and that like so annoying to me I just try to get the fights on the situation where you just can't lose it With no problem, we can win this team with Ramaran. And then the first thing I wanna show you something. I wanna go like this. I wanna show the power of this guy because here I won't need my Bernard, I can use him completely. It will be fun. Well, the problem here is that he has the real rune, so man, that sucks. I'm not gonna waste my skill and just gonna try to stun Perna. I'm gonna reset her. And I can eventlate myself. Now I can kill her right away. Buff my Kona. I'm not gonna hit that guy because he has. I'm gonna reset him now. So he has now no uh, resurrect, resurrect skills. As you can see, I can I can uh, speed up fights a lot. Like this guy is so insane. Like his third skill, I think he'll be such an MVP for Arena, but for real time Arena, but even for Arena. There are some tactics you can use and exploit him and abuse him. This is tricky now. I, because I didn't want, I I knew I, I was going to lose someone here. But now, bye bye. <coughs> and this is because he had defense break. If he had done mm. defense break, he would be like 70k damage. Really high amount. I hope you guys enjoyed the fight, this one was a bit more risky because man, I had to use my rammer and I don't know this fucker speed and my MSH, I don't know if he would outspeed him right away he would I think because this Orion wasn't that fast so that's the problem, Orion forces me just to use a lot of um, a 
a bit more riskier tools or else I'm gonna I can get fucked right on the first turn if things go bad. So that's it guys, I hope you guys enjoyed and I see ya next Guild War.